just want to congratulate the Canada team. Um, they play a disciplined game this afternoon. Um, I think some simple, basic mistake from our team um, cost us the game. But um, I think, again, we have to look back and where we go wrong and move on. Okay, so who wants to be the first one? Okay. But I think uh, um, our defensive unit never operate. Um, we weren't organized at times. You know, the Canada team was playing on one strike up front, and most of the time that striker is free. He picked up the football, and that one of, that one of those challenges was cost us the goal. I just had a question for you. After Thursday's practice for Canada, Coach Stephen Hart said that he knew what to expect from Jamaica. And from what I saw out there, it looked like he knew exactly what kind of strategy he wanted to employ against uh, your team today. Do you find that uh, Canada neutralized your strength, which is uh, speed and uh, play on the outside? Well, I don't really think so. You know, when, you, when you win a game of football, you can't come and say anything, you know. But um, again, they play a disciplined game. Uh, we get our chances. I don't think um, our strikers play to their strength this afternoon. Um, I recall a full of Luton and Shelton. Okay, next. Talk a little bit about uh, Jonathan Ricketts' game. Um, Jonathan, uh, uh, good performance this afternoon. Um, I think he came up big and made two good saves as keepers in, in, in the game as well. But Jonathan is a good goalkeeper. Okay. I think we're a bit flat arm in the first half, to be honest. We're a bit flat, especially in the midfield. You know, the six and the thirteen and the twenty, they, they were the three players who played the game for, for, for the Canada team and then in the second half we made some adjustment and that's where the difference. Okay, next. You have another one? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, again, uh, unfortunate for Ricardo Fuller because normally on a, a regular day he will put away those chances. But we just have to move on. Okay. Who's next one? Okay. Do you think that the referee had to do anything with the, the final result? <laughs> well, again, that's his job, you know. You know, he, he's the one who is in charge. He, he makes his call. So I can comment on that. Well, as again, we weren't aggressive in the in the first half. I think we give um, we allow the Canadian team to control the first half, especially in, in the middle of the park, and that's where we organize and get our game together. Okay, okay. So thank you very much. Okay. We'll be back very shortly with Coach Stephen Hart and as well as the Miller Light Man of the Match. Okay. Okay, and we're beginning exactly with Ali Gerber. He was chosen the Miller Light Man of the Match. So let's give him an award right here. Thank, thank you very much for coming. Congratulations for your play tonight. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, let's start then. Would you like to uh, comment a little bit on this match tonight? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, let's just let's just start with a few comments from you. Yeah, just just a little general comments about this match tonight. Yeah. In general, listen, the guy that came, uh, you know, we have an intention to get the, the three points. So we got the three points. I think the, the guy that played great and we keep, you know, the, we keep the defensive, uh, you know, very tight and we try to keep the best, the best space so we can, you know, we can keep it in front of us. So, and we have a, you know, we have a good occasion and I put the ball in. Okay, so let's start with questions for Ali only. Coach Stephen Hart will be afterwards. Yes. Um, Ali, can you describe how the scoring sequence took place from your perspective? Oh, I think it was, um, you know, the ball was going pretty, you know, pretty fast. I see Mike on the um, on the wing, he crossed the ball. Naturally, you know, he just followed the ball with the eyes, and I keep my eyes on the ball, and I hit it on the net. That's it. Yes, okay, next, next question right here. You, you, oh, just okay. So anybody with uh, some more questions? Okay. Ali, it seems like wherever you go, you're scoring goals, but uh, it seems you kind of sometimes staying with the club. What is it about your style of play that maybe makes you underrated by certain people, despite that you score almost goal every two games wherever you go? Oh, it's you know, it's a matter of you know, find a place then I fit more and you know, with my style of playing. You know, and football is like that. Sometimes you have to be at a good moment and a, uh, at the right place. So. That's it. I don't really know, so I can't really explain. So, just have to keep scoring. Okay, next one. Okay. Ali, uh, besides the goal tonight, you scored two against Guatemala in Oxnard. Uh, how do you feel your game is coming together? Oh, you know, with the experience and with the quality of play that I have around me. So, you know, I can't say it's pretty easy, but the guy that play the game very well, they read the game very well. So it's kind of, you know, a little bit easy. You know, the more you get your confidence when you're, for, when you're forward, the more you score, the more your confidence get, you know, get boosted. Okay, one final question. No? Great. So, oh, there you go. Okay. Of course, you know you never go, you never step on the field with thinking that you're gonna lose. So might as well not show, don't show up for the game. Okay, Ali, thank you very much. Congratulations for the award. Okay, so we begin now with Coach um, Stephen Hart, who wants to begin with the questions. Okay. Coach Just wanted to ask you a question. Some would say that your decision to start Greg Sutton in goal ahead of Josh Wagner would be a stroke of genius, given what happened today. What was the um, well, I discussed it with the coaching staff. Uh, we, 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 we knew Jamaica, very powerful in the air, very strong. And, and we felt that a big part of their game would be, one, uh, getting crosses in on us, and then on the set plays, putting us under pressure. Uh, and in, in that situation, we just thought that uh, Sutton would be the best, best person to go with. Yes. Yeah, um, well, I mean, the, the the individual defending of the back line was very good, but uh, I, I think the whole compactness of the team, uh, midfield and back line, um, you, you know, we 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 kept it tight. Uh, we, we managed to squeeze balls, don't give them a lot of speed. We were really concerned about the Fuller Shelton combination. Um, early on, they, they put us under some trouble, but I, I, I think in general we solved that problem uh, very well. Yes? You said after uh, the practice on Thursday that uh, you had an idea of uh, what to expect from Jamaica. Were you surprised with how well uh, your strategy uh, worked today when it came to keeping the ball away from them and keeping it confined in the middle? I think we could have done better. Um, I, I, I thought we played very well in the first half, created, created some good chances, uh, chances and half chances. In the second half, we opened brightly, uh, had two very good chances. I thought Ricketts was outstanding. Um, and, and then we fell apart a bit. Uh, I think we fatigued a bit. And, and when we fatigued, instead of keeping the ball and resting with it, uh, we gave it away. And once you give it away, now you've got to work to get it back. Um, so I, I think that is something we need to, to sit down and, and discuss and, and uh, do better in the next game. Yes. Talk a little bit about the goal. Yeah. Um, 
Well, it's as Ali described it. Uh, the ball got wide. Uh, Klakowski, nice little overlap. And uh, the cross came in. I actually saw Ali peeling away, and I thought he was going to bring it down. I'm glad he didn't. <laughs> um, but it was a great, great finish. Uh, nice play in general, but, but a fantastic finish. OK. Yeah. Oh. You can go first. Stevie, it looked like you started with a 4-5-1 with Ali by himself up front. And then when you took off uh, Will Johnson to bring on Jackson, it gave him a bit more support up front. Did you feel that was key to developing the goal? And, and how did the two formations compare for you? Well, it, it wasn't intended to be a 4-5-1. Uh, it was supposed to be a 4-3-3. And we talked about that in the dressing room, that we, that we were lacking uh, penetration on both wide areas of the field. Um, we, we had a tendency to play in front of them, and I wasn't happy with that. Um, and, and when you play a 4-3-3 uh, and you're not getting the penetration out wide, then it, it ends up coming to be a 4-5-1. Um, so so we, we, we knew we had to make changes. It was just, a, you know, what, what's the timing would be the changes. Okay. Why, why, the, why that change? Why pulling off Johnson? He seemed to be causing Jamaica some problems. Um, well, it wasn't so much, uh, um, you know, Johnson had to probably be sacrificed. Um, but what we felt was we could, we could, get, some, we could get some penetration on, on the left side with Josh coming in. And, and then uh, Josh has a tendency to play a little bit higher up. Um, so Patrice is a little more disciplined in, in what he did, and, and Johnson did a lot of work. Um, so it was just, you know, six or one, half a dozen or the other in the change ready. Okay. I just wanted you to comment on uh, Greg Sutton's play, uh, given that he was just released from Toronto FC uh, not too long ago. Were you surprised with how well he performed, given that he hadn't had ma much match action recently? No. <laughs> I mean, to be honest, he's trained very well. Um, I think he has something to prove. Um, and uh, Ali could tell you he, he's been outstanding. Actually, both goalkeepers have been outstanding in training. Um, me personally, I, I could have gone with either one, but as I told you, we, we had a reasoning for that. But no, I'm not surprised. Okay, thank you very much, Ali, Coach Stephen Hart. Congratulations and good luck thank for the you rest very much. of the competition.